Welcome to Speak English Now podcast with your host, Georgiana, the podcast that will help you to speak English fluently with no grammar and no textbooks. Hi, thanks for joining me for another episode. I'm Georgiana, and my mission is to help you improve your English fluency. If you want to support me, it's very simple. Share the podcast with your friends and family. That would mean a lot. Thanks. Before we start, get the transcript on my website, speakenglishpodcast.com. Okay, let's start. Today we will talk about one of my favorite movies, Gone with the Wind. It's a romantic drama set during the American Civil War and its aftermath. The movie takes place in the southern United States during the Civil War. The South is known for its elegance and charm, and the attention to detail in the movie is amazing. You'll see beautiful dresses, sprawling plantations, and stunning landscapes, but also the dark side of war and destruction as the Civil War brings devastation and loss to the region. The main characters in the movie are Scarlett O'Hara and Red Butler. Scarlett is a young woman who is used to getting her way. That means she always got what she wanted, in spite of opposition. She's in love with Ashley Wilkes, who is engaged to her cousin, Melanie Hamilton. Scarlett is determined to win Ashley's heart, but her world is turned upside down when the war breaks out. The other main character named Rhett is a charming man who acts carelessly and recklessly. But he becomes enamored with Scarlett's fiery personality and tries to win her over throughout the movie. The conflict in the movie is emotional and intense. We see the devastation of war and its impact on Scarlett and those around her. Scarlett struggles to adapt to the new reality and she's forced to do whatever it takes to survive. Although Red tries to win her over, she's still in love with Ashley and can't let go of her obsession with him. Scarlett's journey throughout the movie is incredible. She goes from being a spoiled young woman to a strong and resourceful survivor, doing whatever it takes to protect herself and her family. And although she faces incredible challenges and tragedies, Scarlett never gives up hope. Red's journey is also fascinating. He starts off as a carefree and reckless man. But as he falls in love with Scarlett, he shows a more tender side. He's not perfect and makes mistakes, but he's a complex and interesting character. One of the movie's main themes is the resilience of the human spirit. We see the characters face incredible challenges and tragedies, but they find ways to adapt and survive, even when it seems impossible. Another theme is the impact of war on society and relationships. The Civil War serves as a backdrop for the story, highlighting how it changed the South forever. The movie can be a good starting point to learn more about the Civil War period. However, it's important to remember that the movie is a work of fiction, not a completely accurate depiction of history. Overall, Gone with the Wind is a fantastic movie I highly recommend. 
After you watch the movie, I would love to hear your thoughts and feedback. Okay, now let's continue with a point of view story. I will tell the same story twice, so make sure to focus on the changes. You can find these techniques fully implemented in my premium courses at speakenglishpodcast.com slash courses. Okay, let's start. Scarlett O'Hara was a headstrong young woman. She grew up on Tara, her family's plantation located in Georgia. When the Civil War broke out, her life changed forever. She fell in love with Ashley, but he was already promised to someone else. Despite this, Scarlett never gave up on her love for him. As the war continued, Scarlett had to learn how to adapt and survive in a constantly changing world. She worked tirelessly to keep Tara alive, despite facing incredible challenges and tragedies. One day, she met a charming man named Rhett, and he was unlike anyone she had ever met. Although their relationship was complicated, their deep connection kept them together. Throughout her journey, Scarlett learned many important lessons about life, love, and the importance of family and friends. Tara was always a constant in her life, a symbol of her past and future, reminding her of her roots and the importance of where she came from. After the war, Scarlett faced many struggles and challenges. She had to rebuild Tara and provide for her family, and she was fiercely protective of her home and loved ones. She had many incredible relationships throughout her journey that helped her grow and learn. Ashley taught her about love and longing. Red about passion and resilience, and her family taught her about loyalty and strength. In the end, Scarlett went from being a spoiled young woman to a strong and resourceful survivor, and her story will always be remembered as a testament to the human spirit. Let's listen to the same story from Scarlett's point of view. Hi, I'm Scarlett, and I grow up on Tara, our family's plantation in Georgia. As a young woman, I am always headstrong. But when the Civil War breaks out, my life changes forever. I fall in love with Ashley even though he's already promised to someone else. Still, I never give up on my love for him. As the war continues, I have to learn to adapt and survive in a constantly changing world. I work tirelessly to keep Tara alive, despite facing incredible challenges and tragedies. And then, one day, I meet a man who is unlike anyone I have ever met before. His name is Red, and he is charming and enigmatic. Although our relationship is complicated, we have a deep connection that keeps us together. Throughout my journey, I learned many important lessons about life love, and the importance of family and friends. Tara is always a constant in my life, a symbol of my past and future, 
reminding me of my roots and the importance of where I come from. After the war, I have many struggles and challenges. I have to rebuild Tara and provide for my family. And I'm fiercely protective of my home and loved ones. But through it all, I have many incredible relationships that help me grow and learn. Ashley teaches me love and longing. Red about passion and resilience. And my family teaches me loyalty and strength. In the end, I learned the power of perseverance, the importance of family, and the resilience of the human spirit. I go from being a spoiled young woman to a strong and resourceful survivor. And my story will always be remembered as a testament to the human spirit. Okay, that's the end of this short exercise. Notice that the changes between grammar points are subtle but important. With this method, you don't need to memorize any boring rules. It's better to see the changes in the proper context. And with a story, it is much easier to remember all this. Visit speakenglishpodcast.com slash courses to get my premium courses. They are designed for learning by listening. It's the perfect time to start a new course. Okay, we have reached the end of this episode. See you soon. Bye-bye. Did you enjoy today's episode? Get the transcript now at speakenglishpodcast.com.